And just when you think you understand yeah. everything, everything, like changes. last season, <laughs> everything changed. The following program, Modern Style. I was floored by the first episode. They don't waste any time. No. And it's theories and things that I think are almost impossible to figure out or guess. There's no, there's no formula. Just when you think you've seen your fellow actors do the most extraordinary work, it just takes, takes my breath away. It's a very ambitious season. Uh, there's a lot going on. I'm trying to speak as vaguely as possible. I'm not so sure that every person you see on the screen in this, in this particular show is not a droid. I don't know, I'm just saying. Relative to the first season, um, you know, the scale is, uh, is greatly expanded. I mean, this, the, the, the first season almost looks like kind of a, you know. <laughs> a fun like little a, workshop. Like a little kitchen drama <laughs> compared <laughs> to where we are now. I feel like we've had to let go a lot. Even though we own our characters, I slightly had to let go of the reins. I've had to see her grow up in a different way and feel that, and it's, it's painful. Bernard is, is in a kind of interesting place relative to this host rebellion because he's the one character who really has you know, a foot in both worlds. The host uprising, well, Dolores is at the front lines, and I think what we're gonna see from her this season is um, a newfound strength and intelligence, but underneath all that, there's still this kind of vulnerable woman who feels the weight of the burden of, of what she has to do and what she has to carry out. Unlike Dolores and, uh, and Maeve, Teddy's awakening happened a little later in the season. So that poses a sort of existential challenge to him and a moral challenge. On the first season, he's looking for this maze. From what I gather, he didn't quite make it, but we'll see what happens. Is that vague enough? <laughs> <laughs> I think everyone this season has a lot more to do and a lot more yeah. to play with because this season we're broken out of our programming more. So you really get to see everyone's range and, and the colors of, of the characters and the different layers. And, and the different perspectives too. Is, that's something that's incredible. We're all basically pawns in Jonah and Lisa's minds, yeah. you know, and in their creative exploration of their own psyches. I'm not quite sure what's going on. <laughs> Westworld kind of predicted this or, or at least was reflecting on a really deep, fundamental level what we need to address as a, as a humanity, as a single humanity. It's scary how much life has imitated art this season. Mm -hmm. The running theme is, uh, you know, do you know where you are and have you ever questioned the nature of your reality? And I think we're all, we all live that pretty much every day. But I think as well, the audience will be asking uh, those questions of themselves too. 